Hi, hi everyone. My name is Daniel Leonard. Um, there is an African coin. There is a guy. He's called Anthony Saint. He made uh, a cryptocurrency. It's called Onyx Coin. <laughs> that guy is a Ugandan, but I think he basically lives in Kenya, Nairobi, most of his times. But the invest of his cryptocurrencies are actually in Uganda and Kenya. But I think mostly Uganda because he's a Ugandan. Um, his cryptocurrency is Ethereum based. It's an Ethereum token, if I'm not mistaken, or if they didn't change the technology. But that's what his cryptocurrency is. So it's basically a Ugandan coin. It has something like, is it one billion? Some things, some big supply, some very, very big supply. And the value is really very low. It's like 0, 0.0 something. It's really very low. So a friend of mine invested in it and I was like, but why did we invest in Onyx coin? What technology do they have? What solution are they bringing? Like, what solution are they creating that is the, the problems that Bitcoin or Ethereum or any other cryptocurrency is having? And she was like, I don't know. I just invested. They just told me to invest and I invested. So, <laughs> I personally believe Anthony's cryptocurrency is going nowhere. Okay? Uh, I don't think it's creating it any solution for anything it's just a cryptocurrency like any other token like any other token you've seen launching making icos and after launching on market it goes down so right now onyx coin hasn't paid its people it hasn't paid its people okay it hasn't paid its people i heard that there are angel investors who are going to be paid in this december around christmas season I'm not sure about it, but I think it was a lie because they told them to give in their 5% of their entire token holding that they, they bought, that they will trade for them. But I don't know where they, which extent they are trading at. I don't know if they have ready buyers because for you to trade, you must, you must be having buyers. Okay, so if it doesn't have a demand, where will they save the 5% of each investor's money? I really don't like it. I, I feel it's scammy. I feel it just corrected money from the ICOs. I really don't like it. That's my view. That's my view. As me, 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 Daniel Leonard, without anybody attached, that's my view. I think Onyx Coin is going nowhere. Doesn't have a technology, doesn't have a cause. It's just like any other token. I haven't gone to their end offices because I'm not I'm not interested. I read at their website. I saw how their wallet works. It's a it's a web something something, but it's not cool. It's not interesting. The technology is low. The levels of website development they are having is really very poor. So I really don't know what's happening. Whether the crypto education in Africa is very very low. Like a person just invests in anything 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 available. So I really don't think it's cool and I think we really still need more of this information, we need more of education, there is something lacking according to the African standards of cryptocurrencies and investments. People are still taking it as an investment thing, invest and get rich, if you don't get rich then your heart broken. So I really think there is something big that should actually be done, okay? Um, bye for now.